Hello everyone, welcome back to Christina Land, a place for grown-up gift givers and adult toy collectors. So today I'm going to compare my 2010 Tiana to the 2022 Tiana that I just bought. And I'm also going to put on the accessory pack that was available for Tiana in 2021 and still is on Amazon actually for I think a little over $9, which I'll put a link to and that's an affiliate link so if you use that, I will make a small commission. Thank you. It'll help the channel. I'm going to put that on the 2022 Tiana. But first, before I do that, I want to compare my 2010 Tiana to the 2022 Tiana. So with the 2010 Tiana, she did come with a tiara that looked just like the one on the 22 one. 2022. 20, <laughs> 2022 one. So what a plastic tiara with white leaves. And however, you can tell that the 2010 Tiana is different as she has an open smile. Uh, they both have brown skin, black hair, and an updo, whereas the 2010 one, aside from the curl on the forehead, like the 2022 one, it also has, she has two little curl tendrils near her ears. They both have black eyebrows, brown eyes, although the 2010 Tiana looks a little bit bigger eyes. Her face is a little bit rounder as well. The lipstick seems the same, although again, the 2010 Tiana has an open smile and the 2022 has a closed smile. The bodice of their dress looks very similar, although this one has more glitter detail at the top. So they both have the white little flowerish type of part on their chest area and then green wraparound layers. The 2022 one has a white cloth flower that I believe is a lily, like a water lily, I think. Um, the 2010 one has a stiffer white flower with a little jewel, an orange jewel in the middle. Fake jewel, obviously, not real. <laughs> they are both articulated the same. Let's see. So the 2010 Tiana can move left and right, up and down. Uh, a little bit more stiff. This Tiana, the 2022 Tiana, moves better up and down, but she has articulation in the shoulders and the elbows and the wrist as well. The 2010 Tiana has a little leaf from the white flower with two little ribbons, dark green ribbons coming down. She has green layers on her dress. The 2022 Tiana does not have any ribbons or anything that attached to the white flower. And then a lot of glitter on these green layers, these light green layers. Whereas the 2010 Tiana, it's just the only glitter is on the outline of the skirt. So this material feels nice to me because I do not like the feel of glitter at all. And then the 2010 Tiana has a kind of cream colored skirt with gold glitter uh, curly designs. No underlayer. Whereas the 2022 one has a clear, clear uh, overskirt with glitter, green leaf glitter designs and then an underskirt. And this Tiana, 2000, oh man, she's glittery. She's so glittery. <laughs> Look how glittery her legs are. It's just bad. So bad. Anyway, this was back when they made high heels for the Disney Store dolls. So she has green high heels instead of flat like her. And I bought this Tiana accessory pack, which is what she wears during her dream sequence of I'm almost there when she sings I'm almost there. Um, yeah, so I originally bought the accessory pack to use with my 2010 Tiana, but then I realized that 2010 Tiana has so much glitter on her legs, like just an incredible amount of glitter, that uh, since this is such a short dress, I can't have her glitter legs show up. Um, also, with the 2010 Tiana, they also had dress packs. So with it came this, the yellow work dress she wears in the bakery, the yellow dress with the white apron, and then the blue dress, which I love, and my Tiana is almost always in the blue dress, but I'm going to quickly put this dress on the 2010 
you know what? No, we're going to put the yellow dress actually on this girl because she doesn't have glitter everywhere. So I'm going to pause really quickly and do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so it's interesting when I put the yellow dress on the new Tiana, and this dress is from 2010, this excess, uh, dress pack. The Velcro on the dress does not fit her very well. It is very tight. So I'm going to actually put the yellow dress on my 2010 Tiana, because I don't think I've ever actually put it on her. I've just put the blue dress on the 2010 Tiana to see if it fits. So I'll be back again. Okay, the yellow waitress dress with the white apron does fit the 2010 Tiana better. The Velcro is still a teeny bit tight, but not like it is on the 22 Tiana. And again, this yellow dress and the beautiful blue dress that she wears uh, when she goes on the balcony was available in a 2010 set that also came with Tiana and Prince Naveen as frogs, like plastic frogs, which I have somewhere, but I don't know where. All right, I'm gonna open this because surely it can't take that long. Also, this came exceedingly damaged, as you can tell. And I got this from the Disney store, not Amazon, and it came very, very damaged. I also bought an aerial accessory pack, and that came in a box, whereas this came in an envelope, and... I mean, the outfit doesn't seem to be damaged, but the box. <laughs> yeah, this is how the box came, because it was shoved into an envelope. Like a padded envelope. Just, like, weird. Okay, so I'm just going to open this, because surely this won't take that too long. You know. Oh, okay, good, good. Alright, put that down so you don't cut yourself. Got it. Okay. I'm taking this out of here. You can see, oh, I like that. This uh, fake white fur wrap. It's beautiful. And it feels so nice and soft. Um... The dress that she wears in the dream sequence when she sings Almost There to her mom. It's like a flapper detail uh, printed on design. I thought it had glitter on the front, but it doesn't, which is great because my fingers don't like glitter. So it's like a cream design uh, 1920s flapper dress. And it has um, water lilies on the front. It also has trumpets on the design, and it does have some gold little straps that are glitter. And then it has a little headband, a little plastic gold headband with a white feather on the top. And then it comes with a microphone so she can sing into it. It also comes with white flat shoes. And I'm assuming a paper or cardboard poster of her restaurant, Tiana's, that she dreams of. Okay, now I'll pause the video so I can dress this Tiana the 22 Tiana in this, and then I'm going to dress my 2010 Tiana in the blue dress. So I'll do that all off camera and show you how it is, and I'll be right back. Okay, well, she's gorgeous in this. <laughs> Just gorgeous. Um, I don't think she really needed this plastic microphone. Like, it's... Uh, so in the accessory pack is this very, very plasticky microphone. It's like a, I don't know, a cross between pearl, maybe gray. It's a little bit moldy. You can tell it's a microphone, like a microphone with a microphone stand from the 1920s. It's very, very flimsy plastic, like very lightweight. Her outfit, however, Look at that. That is gorgeous. Now, I did take off her tiara um, so I could put the feather, the plastic feather boa on. And because I took off her tiara, some of it got with me trying to take it off and carefully snapping it, it. There was one section that got stuck on the right side of her hair that took a while to get off. So, if you want to take the tiara off of your doll, um, you might get her hair a little messed up, but that's okay. She looks so beautiful in this outfit. Look how gorgeous she is. I love the little gold tassels on the, like, the flapper style on her dress. And then just white flat shoes. And she does have a little bit of glitter on her legs. Oh, also, with the shoes, since, or her feet rather, since the straps were like, on her sh like on her feet to keep her green shoes on you can see there's indentations in her shoes 
where the straps were on, which is annoying because they put them on so tight. So that's something to keep in mind too. <laughs> I was just going to say that Ariel didn't have indentations on her feet when I changed into her outfit, but I realized it's because she had a mermaid tail and she had no shoes on her first outfit. So that would be why, Christina. Good job. Thank you. And let's now put her with the fur wrap, fake fur wrap. I really love this outfit because it feels nice to my fingers. There's like, the only part that's a little bit glittery are the little gold straps that are on her dress. But even that doesn't feel too bad actually. So I don't know if it's necessarily glitter or just the way the material they used. It feels great. <laughs> so if you're someone who has sensitive fingers and you really like the Tiana doll but not necessarily her dress, this is a great alternative. And again, it is on Amazon. So most of the accessory packs, yeah, they have. They're either $9.99 or $9.50, like on Amazon. Um, wow. Yeah, they have all of them on Amazon. Excepting Jasmine. So here is the blue dress that came with the 2010 pack. And this is the one that I keep on the 2010 Tiana because I love the blue dress. And again, in the movie, she has gloves with the blue dress, just like in the green dress, so I don't know why they didn't give her gloves, but they didn't. But it's a strapless blue dress that is great material because my fingers like it. <laughs> There's no glitter on it at all. Um, it's, she's so beautiful in blue. Like, she really is. If you guys can find her in a blue dress or some blue dress accessory, I highly, highly recommend it because she's just gorgeous in blue, and I just love this ball dress. So here are the two Tianas in their different outfits. I absolutely love, 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 love this 99 accessory pack. And um, I think it would actually fit the 2010 doll. I'm not going to do it um, because, like I said before, my 2010 Tiana doll is, the legs are just covered with glitter. Just, just covered, covered, man. Just so much glitter. But I think based on the fact that the 2010s outfits were a little tight on the 2022 doll means that the 2021 20, 2021 accessory pack should be able to fit the 2010 doll. The other thing that comes with the set is this cardboard poster of Tiana's restaurant. I tried to get Tiana to hold it, but she just, it was not going to stay. So it's just a very cardboard, just a piece of cardboard poster of Tiana's restaurant. I don't think the microphone is needed. That's, I'm not going to keep that. It's flimsy. It doesn't like it right now. It's barely staying on a flat surface. So, um, but the dress, the faux fur shawl, this feather, um, you know, the shoes are nothing to write home about. They're just white flats. This is worth it. This is worth it. And I did pay $9.99 for it um, back when it was available on the Disney store. So it's worth it. If you have Amazon Prime, it's $9.99. Get it. I'll put a link to it again. And if you use that link to buy that or anything else, it's an affiliate link. So I'll get a small commission for that. Thank you. It will help the channel. Um, she's so beautiful. I'm so glad I got this Tiana so I could put this outfit on her. And she just looks so fashionable. I can't tell if I like her better with the shawl or if not. Let me know which one you like better. Do you like the the fur wrap better or do you prefer it without the fur wrap? Oh, she's so beautiful. I'm so glad I got this. This is, I really hope Disney makes more accessory packs and I hope that's why they're all sold out on the Disney store because they're going to make more because I would love them. Love them. Especially for Tiana. She needs all the outfits. Okay, thank you so much for watching. And uh, please let me know what you think of Tiana, what you think of her outfits, what you think especially of this one. Do you have a favorite one? Do you like her blue ball gown? Do you wish that she came in her blue ball gown? Gown? Not ground. I don't know what ground is. I do. <laughs> um, let me know which of Tiana's outfits is your favorite. Um, I absolutely love this one. Um, but then I kind of like the one she wore at the masquerade too. I don't know, it's just fascinating looking. But then I also like the one that she wears in the very end when she's in a restaurant. But then I, okay, I'm just going to say everyone that I like, so I'm going to stop. Oh, I also wish to make her coat, like in her hat. Yeah, 
Okay, <laughs> basically I want all the outfits for Tiana and hopefully we'll get them and we'll get more of them because of Tiana's series. Okay, I'm done. I just, I, in case you couldn't tell, I love Tiana's outfits so much and we need more of them. <laughs> okay, but I'm done now. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Please hit the bell so you can be notified of when my videos come out. I'm trying to do them twice a week, so it's important to ring that bell um, so you get notified of when they will come out. And I usually do Fridays, but when I do earlier in the week, it's kind of it's kind of all up in the air of when that time will be. Do you have a preference, by the way, for when I should release my videos? Let me know in the comments. And just thank you again so much for watching. And remember, it's okay to like what you like, be who you are, and stay young at heart. And I'm going to have both Tiana's wave. And, um, <laughs> because they'll fall down if I try to make their hands wave. I'm just, oh, okay. That, that Tiana looks like her arm hurts. So there we go. So I'm just going to like move them like this and just, just think that they're waving. Yeah. Right. Let's see. Yeah. Just think that they're waving. Whoops. Her shawl comes off. That's okay. She doesn't want to wear her shawl right now. Okay. Bye.